Hey everyone, how's it going? Hassan here. So, this past weekend I went to New York uh, to visit my friend Udit and uh, just to kind of explore and everything. So, um, I was there, I left uh, Friday evening and I was there all day Saturday, all day Sunday, and then I was there like Monday morning and then I came back. So, I was back home Monday evening. Um, and it is now New Year's Eve right now. We're getting pretty close to, uh, yeah, it's 10.36 right now, so a little over an hour away until it's the new year. So I don't know when I will exactly post this this video, but um, but yeah, so I was in New York over the weekend, and I kind of filmed little bits here and there. So um, here is the footage. I'll kind of show you all the footage, and then at the very end, I will explain in detail a bit more about uh, about my trip. Hey everyone, Hustin here. I am please, in please film. New York. Please film right I am in New York. <laughs> we are please film right going to be vlogging throughout my trip. I'm going to be vlogging throughout my trip. This guy is running away from me. Come back with it. <laughs> so, I will be vlogging throughout and we will see the sights of New York. Should be fun, so enjoy.
Nintendo Fuse. We're a bunch of, we're big Nintendo fans. Oh, sure. I say, hey, hello to all my friends. It's at Nintendo News. It's to me, Luigi. Ho, ho. You guys, uh, I wish you the happy, happy, happy New Year. You number one. Whoopee. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you, Luigi. Thanks. Thank you a lot, Nintendo News. some dessert as you can see all the lights and stuff here. How is it Udi? Weird. <laughs> Weird? No. It is bitter. bitter. Well it's we'll see how this is. Yeah. This is the one that I got. Let's see how this is. Why does someone 
All right, so we just ate some dessert, and now, oh, it's really dark. There you go, and I kind of see me. So now we are headed towards, uh, well, we're meeting somebody who's selling us tickets to a comedy show. Uh, this is, we'll see, we'll see how this goes. Um, oh, there's a glove on the ground. Um, the camera at you. No, I just totally <laughs> the There's Udit on the camera. What? And just... Carla, and there's Crystal. And we are all headed to... We're talking to some sketchy guy who's gonna sell us some tickets. Yeah, if this, well, I guess I was about to say if this is the last <laughs> thing you see, but if, if it's really sketchy, you probably won't even see this. Bye. <laughs> so, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> last video ever. <laughs> There's some candy canes up there. So in case you wanna know where our bodies are, <laughs> there are the candy canes right there. We'll see how this goes, and we're gonna get tickets to this comedy show. Should be fun if we survive this, and uh, then uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Focus. Why is it so blurry? Apple store. Everybody. <laughs> all right, so we just got our tickets. Alive. It was it was not <laughs> sketch at all. It's pretty cool, right, Udit? Sketchy as hell, man. We're no, alive. it was pretty cool. We're alive. We got our tickets. We're headed to the comedy show, and it should be fun. So I will let you guys know what I thought about it. There's the Nintendo store, and right next to it, look at that great sight. All right, so we finished up with the comedy show, and it was it was all right. It had its moments, um, and uh, yeah, it was interesting. Definitely, um, kind of need to to see some sort of a show here in, in New York. And now we are kind of. Closing out the day, slowly making our way back and seeing what else we got here. Um, so yeah, that's that. And so I will continue to, to film more tomorrow as well. So we'll see what uh, what we end up doing. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Day two, it's Sunday here in New York, and uh, so just giving you a heads up that I might not be able to film too much because it is raining. Uh, probably can't see that on the camera, but uh, so I will try and film little bits here and there, uh, and uh, so we'll see how that goes. But just giving you a heads up, might not be too much, but I will tell you guys all about my New York experiences later on when I get back home as well. So uh, yeah, see you guys later. All right, hey everyone, I am in Image Anime, so I just wanted to film a little bit here and then I'll see what they got and see what I want to uh, to pick up. But here's a, a little display case and stuff here. So those are some of the uh, Power Ranger figure arts. I have all of these guys, and I think I have to review all of them still, so I'll be reviewing those soon. What the hell is that? What? Oh, that thing? Yeah, what is it? I don't know what that is. Yeah, it's creepy looking. <laughs> That is interesting. It's like a volcano attached to like a dinosaur or something. It's weird. Yeah, I don't know what that <laughs> thing is. Oh, there's the Daijujin back there, which I got. Gallant Mon and other stuff. But, uh, yeah, they got a bunch of interesting things. Ooh, the Super Samurai. Deluxe set. I'm so tempted to get that thing, but it's it's pricey, so I don't think I will. But that would be really sweet. But it's I think a bit too much for my budget. Got some Go Busters. Oh, they got the other SPD team here. The full team. I'll have to see if I get that or not. Do I have to bleach yourself? Other interesting little things. Oh, okay, okay, I'll show you. 
I see a GoBusters here. Interesting. Buy a mystery bag? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know about that. There you go, man. Yeah. <laughs> Problem is, I don't know most of the stuff here. Yeah. Oh, there's Halo up here. Well, that would be that would be interesting, though. Oh, you get is. a mystery bag and you have to like look everything up. Halo Play Arts action figure pie. Right. Yeah, right. That would. Be... <laughs> You're not <even> listening. <laughs> I, I wouldn't. I would. Oh, there's C3PO. They have a C3PO thing. That's pretty interesting. Yeah, they have a lot of cool stuff here. Interesting things. Lots of movies and stuff too. Oh, there's... Oh, is that the... The Disney thing up there? I think it is. Ah, oh, now I have to decide what to get because there's like a bunch of stuff. But there's lots of movies and things here. Here's all the ranger keys and everything. I don't have that set. I have these guys. I have the samurai team. I don't have that. But they have a bunch of ranger keys here, so if there's any you're looking for, check it out. Image anime. They got the cure user stuff here too. And a bunch of other things. These are all the figure arts that they got here. And they have all of the different Mighty Morphin ones as well. Pokendra Operation Overdrive ones I just got. There's Duke Mon there, aka Gallant Mon. And yeah, they got a bunch of stuff, so I'm gonna go take a look and then I will let you guys know what I get. But uh, I'll probably get, I'm thinking maybe of Deca Red. He's one that I still need for my collection, so I'll probably get him and then we'll see if they have any other stuff as well. So stay tuned for that. This train's in three minutes. You have anything to say to the camera? Don't, don't record me. I'm gonna sue you. I'm suing him for recording me. Park, somebody just slid in the ice skating rink, and uh, yeah, um, funny thing, right there, that's the Empire State Building right there, but you can't see it, like literally right there is the Empire State Building, but because of all the fog and the, the rain and, and all that stuff, you can't really see it there, um, so that's kind of funny, it's like hiding in the shadows there, um, but yeah, there's an ice skating rink here in Bryant Park, there's a Christmas tree, Stuff here. There's all the little, uh, all the little shops and stuff. <laughs> all the little shops and everything. And uh, yeah, so we're just out here, Bryant Park, just kind of checking stuff out. You should, uh, you should record people falling on their butts. I did. Well, as soon as I started recording, somebody <laughs> fell. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, so that is. Oops, can't see myself. Um, so we are just right here. We kind of spent the day. Uh, had a late start to the day because we had a late end to yesterday and then went to uh, Brooklyn for a bit and now here and just kind of chilling and relaxing and oh snap now you can see the Empire State Building. I told you it was it. So there it is. I told you it was hiding in the shadows. I told you well, it was it. Well, you told me and then I told you but whatever. I'm messing There's the red and green. Oh, now it's faded. Now it's like disappearing again. But it's there. It's secretly hiding there. Um, so yeah, so we're just going to kind of relax a bit out here and uh, call it a day soon and then tomorrow I'll be here in the morning taking a bus in the afternoon back and then that's it, back to work and everything. So may or may not record more footage. If there is, it'll be after this. So uh, yeah, see you guys later. And quick little look at Empire State Building. You can kind of somewhat see it right there. Oh, you can see the top of it too and everything. It's pretty cool. It's like glowing right through the fog. Can you actually pick up on camera? Yeah. Nice. Pretty cool. Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's slowly disappearing back into the fog. It's all Christmas there it goes. colors. It is, it's disappearing right as we speak. It's going back into the shadows. Slowly hiding. You could do a time lapse of it. That'd be cool. <laughs> Yeah. Just do backwards, like so it just slowly appears from the shadows. Yeah. So yeah, that's the Empire State Building in hiding right now. 
All right, here's the shop in Bryan Park. It's closed, uh, but like, check this out. There's a lot of cool stuff there. Like right there, that's uh, it's hard to see the glass. That's Boba Fett. There's his helmet and stuff. There's Wally right there. And there's a thing from Star Wars. There's a whole R2 bunch of stuff down there. Here too. Oh yeah. All right. Let's see where's uh. See right down there in the front. Oh yeah. Right up here. R two D two. And some other droids and stuff as well. Right up here. There's a. Uh, I think anyway. Right. Yeah. I think. It's hard to see through the, the stormtroopers. Yeah, There's more Star Wars ships and stuff there. Um, it's really cool. Motorcycles, other things. Yeah, there's a lot of little figurines and stuff in there. There's a, a lot of props and stuff in the back, like like if, different sorry, features. Intro. If you see all the way in the back there, there's a thing that they ride on in Star Wars. I don't know what it's called. Yeah, that thing. I forget. I forget what it's called too. It's cool looking. It's a pretty sweet shop. It's Closed right now. Obviously, this is awesome. Yeah, it's huge. Like Boba Fett right here is sweet. Like here's you can kind of see like his arm and stuff. Like look at that. You can also see some of this. That's really sweet. That is really cool. Look at that guy. We got Darth Vader right here. Oh snap! There's another Boba Fett, and then there's Darth Vader right next to him too. That's really cool how they how they made these things. As you can see, there's lots of other little interesting right there. I'm stepping in a puddle. <laughs> Just give it up. And you can kind of see the backs of these things. So this is uh, Recycled Metal Art. Metal Park, I guess, is the name of the place. That's what it says, yeah. That's they sweet. made all this stuff. It's really cool. That's that so Wally's sweet. awesome right there, as you can see. So yeah, if you're ever in Bryant Park in New York, check out this place, because this is some pretty sweet stuff. And I think they're only going to have this up for a few more weeks. Oh, yeah. And then until next year. You said all the shops and stuff, uh, only a certain time of the year they're open, right? Or, or do they yeah. cycle through stuff? Yeah, like right around Christmas, and they start taking them down, I think, a week or two after the new year. Gotcha. But yeah, I mean, you can see, as you can see, this is some really neat stuff. So yeah, check it out in Bryant Park. A lot of random little neat things in New York, like this little statue here is kind of cool. There's more stuff at the top of the H&M thing there, as you can see. But uh, things here. We're in Times Square. What? You want to eat there or you want to get the... We can get it to go. Yeah, I don't, I don't have to eat here. Yeah. I don't mind. All right, hey everyone. Day three in New York. Uh, very soon, I'm about to head out. It's cold and windy. It is. About to get something to eat and then take the bus. So don't have much time. I wanted to stop by at, stop by FAO Schwartz because I heard that it was a kind of neat toy store and everything. But apparently, everybody wants to as there's a massive lion, as you can see, massive lion going around, and that's the entrance of the buildings over there. So I just decided, you know what? Forget it, I'm not going, don't have much time anyways. Um, so yeah, about to get something to eat, take the bus, and then I will post this vlog and kind of give more details on that. So anyways, see you guys later. So that was that. That was my uh, New York trip. So like I said, I was there pretty much all day Saturday, Sunday, and then a little bit Monday morning. Um, so not too much time, but uh, it was still fun. We did quite a bit, actually. Um, I was pretty tired by the end of it. We did quite a bit. Uh, so I stayed with my friend Uditz, um, and uh, that was that was a lot of fun. And uh, we met up with some friends there, uh, Crystal, excuse me, and I met up, uh, I met someone uh, named Carla as well. So uh, the four of us kind of hung out a bunch, um, especially on Saturday, and that was uh, that was a lot of fun. So it was overall um, a good time, I think. Uh, and uh, like I said, we did a lot of stuff. So Saturday, uh, we kind of explored like Times Square, Rockefeller Center, that whole area, basically. Um, went to the Nintendo store, as you saw. So I got to speak with uh, uh, Luigi there. And that's actually the, the Luigi that you saw that was talking, the animated Luigi. The voice of the Luigi was from Charles Martinet, who is the actor voice of Luigi like the guy that actually does the voice of Mario and Luigi from like the beginning of when Mario and Luigi existed years ago 
he was the one doing the voice. So I guess they have him wherever he is watching and he can interact and everything, which I think is really cool. So that was actually the voice of Luigi. So that was pretty awesome. I told him to give a shout out to Nintendo Fuse. He said Nintendo News, but um, it was still uh, pretty cool. Uh, I wanted to talk more, but there were all these little kids that were just like crowded around there and I really couldn't say too much. Um, but so, yeah, the Nintendo Store had a lot of really cool stuff. Um, it was kind of getting late, getting hungry, and I was with a group of friends and stuff, so I didn't want to spend too much time there, so I kind of like rushed a bit through it. Um, so it would have been cool to kind of go in detail and kind of explore the store a bit more. Um, but uh, I still did everything that I wanted to. I got to see the, the Luigi thing and talk to him. Um, and I got a bunch of stuff as well, so I wanted to show you guys what I got. So first things first, I got a uh, Kirby plush because Kirby is amazing. So I got this uh, this plush of Kirby. It's pretty big and it is uh, very soft and fluffy. It's like my new pillow now. This thing is awesome. So uh, I had to get it. It's Kirby. Like it's it's awesome. Like if you want anything plush, this is nice and soft and this is perfect. So Kirby is Kirby is the best. So there you go. There's Kirby. Um, I also got this shirt because 2013 was the year of Luigi and you know I'm a Luigi fan. I like Luigi. Um, and uh, so I got this shirt. I'll try and hold it up for you all. So it says Nintendo World New York. It's got Luigi on it. Um, the back doesn't have anything but uh, but yeah so Nintendo World can't even see the shirt now. Luigi shirt and yeah anyways you got the idea. Um, so that is exclusive to Nintendo World because it says Nintendo World on it. So I wanted to get something like that um, to remember. Last time I got a uh, Legend of Zelda shirt that says Nintendo World on it, um, which was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, there's that. Then I also got, uh, they had a sale on a bunch of Wii U games. Uh, so this $50 game I got for $15, and it was Just Dance 4. So I haven't even opened this up yet, but um, I've always thought this is kind of interesting, but I never wanted to pay too much for this type of game. Um, I think I've rented one of the Just Dance games or something, and they were kind of fun. So I figured for 15 bucks, might as well get this thing and try it out. So I'm uh, looking forward to, uh, to seeing how that is. Oh, and then last but not least from the Nintendo Store, I also picked up this, uh, this Legend of Zelda Link Figma action figure. So uh, this is like a, a, a collector's item here. It's like a model basically. So he has a bunch of different weapons and accessories and things, and you can kind of uh, pose the figure however you want. Um, so this is pretty sweet. I don't have any of the Figma um, figures yet, but uh, this is my first. And uh, I've opened it up and then I put it back in the box to transport it. But uh, it seemed pretty cool. So I will be doing a review of this. So stay tuned for that review in the future as well. Um, so there's that. And so, oh, and then Saturday night um, went to, as I kind of mentioned in the, in the vlog, um, a comedy show, which was kind of fun. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, it, I mean, it wasn't anything super special, it was alright, but it was, it was still entertaining, I guess. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, it was, um, it was a long day. Towards the end, we saw Secret Life of Walter Mitty, me and Udit, um, and I enjoyed the movie, I thought it was good. Um, so it was a long day, we got back, like I said, pretty late. So Sunday, we kind of got a, a late start to the day, but, um, then we went to, uh, Brooklyn for a little bit to, uh, hang out with the friends, um, and uh, so that was cool. Um, got to uh, go to a little bakery there, um, which was pretty sweet. And then, what did we do? Oh, uh, I went to Image Anime also. I forgot about that. So Image Anime, as you saw in the, in the vlog, all the, the stuff that I filmed. Um, so Image Anime has a bunch of stuff that they import from Japan and everything. And uh, me being a fan of Power Rangers, they have some Power Rangers or Super Sentai stuff, which is what the Japanese Power Rangers is. So I got a couple of the SH Figuarts models. They have the Deca Red, aka Power Rangers SPD Red Ranger. So they have uh, that model there. So pretty sweet. Oops. And uh, the Japanese series right now is uh, Kyuryuger, is what it's called. And uh, so they have the Red Ranger Kyuru Red. So in a couple of years, they will use this for Power Rangers if Power Rangers continues. And uh, I, I've started watching the Japanese show. I thought it was pretty sweet, so I wanted to get uh, this figure as well. So I will be doing reviews of both of those eventually. I still have a ton of stuff to review. It's like piling up. I have a huge list. So I don't know when I'm going to get to those, but I will get to them eventually. Um, so I'm excited about that. I've been collecting a lot more of those those models and stuff as well. Um, and uh, yeah, that, I mean, then after that, um, we kind of went back to uh, Times Square a little bit and explored around and, and kind of checked that stuff out as well. Um, 
And did we do anything else that day? I can't even remember. Everything kind of like blurred together a little bit. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, I don't even know. I mean, but I was, we, we did a bunch of stuff, like I said. And then uh, Monday, tried to stop by FAO Schwartz, but the line was super long, as you saw, so it just uh, didn't work out. But it was still, still pretty cool to, to kind of see. And um, yeah, so that's that. Now I'm back at home now. Um, and uh, I had work today, Tuesday, um, and then I'm off tomorrow because it's New Year's. And just kind of, uh, it's, it's going to be a busy week. Just, I mean, my room right now, I'm not really showing you my room, but it's a huge mess because they just kind of finished painting the house that I know I'd mentioned before. They were going through the whole house and repainting. And uh, a lot of my, like my parents' room was last, so a lot of their stuff is in my room right now. And then they still have to go back and just do little finishing touches here and there throughout the house. So everything is still a huge mess. Um, so I can't really go in the basement and set up my stuff for my reviews yet or really do too much of that. Uh, but I will get around to doing that. I did get this cool thing, though. There's a Kickstarter called Poppy. It was a special Kickstarter project um, that I backed, which was a uh, camera that you could use, like a little um, thing that you could put your iPhone into, and you could record 3D video with it. So it finally finished. I, I backed this like at the beginning of the year, and finally it got completed. So here it is. This is the Poppy. It says Kickstarter Edition on it. Um, this is what this thing looks like. So I may or may not do like a review of this. I don't know, but I will be filming with this. I did film some stuff with it. Uh, basically, you put your iPhone in there, and then this thing, I can't really... It kind of, yeah, trying to do this with one hand, flips open kind of like this. So it's like you, you have your iPhone in there, and you like look through this like that, and you can film in 3D. So it's, uh, it's kind of neat, actually. It works pretty well. I uploaded it to YouTube, uh, some test footage, and it kind of turned out well. So um, I'll be doing a lot more of that. So stay tuned. I'll probably do a, a 3D vlog uh, in the future. I won't be doing too many of it because I know a lot of people don't have 3D stuff. But I will try and film some fun 3D things here and there just for those that do. So you can kind of enjoy that as well. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's really it. Um, like I said, it's uh, just kind of a busy week now. I'm, I'm working the rest of the week. And then next week, school starts again starting Monday. So uh, going to be pretty busy. Um, tomorrow being New Year's. Uh, it's also my parents' 25th anniversary. So um, uh, the uh, I just was out with the family, uh, got dinner and everything tonight just to kind of celebrate my parents' anniversary, which is tomorrow. Um, just got back home a little while ago. Um, so happy anniversary to them. Um, I'm definitely happy for 25 years. is, is pretty cool. So definitely happy for them, and it was fun celebrating with them. Um, and uh, happy New Year to all of you. So uh, I guess you'll probably be seeing this in 2014 by the time I get around to posting it. So uh, it'll already be the New Year. So lots more videos and stuff on the way. Um, one last thing, I do have a special video that I made for the uh, acapella group Pentatonix that I love. Uh, I unfortunately am not able to go to the concert because tickets are sold out. And so I did a little video that I put together and I wanted to send it to them to try and get their attention and see if I could maybe meet them or even go to their concert or something. So I'll put the link in the description box below. Uh, but please check out that video. And please send it to Pentatonix. Like, tweet it to them at PTX Official. Go on their Facebook page, facebook.com slash Pentatonix. Uh, just send it to them uh, as many times as you can and just spread the word on that video. That would really mean a lot to me. I want to get the word out and get people uh, noticing and, and hopefully somehow things will work out. We'll see. Um, but yeah, that's about it. So again, Happy New Year to all of you. Uh, 2014 is going to have lots of great new stuff on the way for me. Uh, I will be doing a vlog about my New Year's resolutions, so uh, stay tuned for that in the next day or two. I'm not sure exactly when I'll get around to doing it, uh, but that will be coming up. So thanks for watching, everybody. Happy New Year. I uh, hope you have a, a safe and, and fun time, and I will uh, see you guys next year. Breaking.